But it's not all depressing news out there. Some of it is just infuriating. <laughs> like today's appearance by attorney general and man regretting that breakfast burrito. <laughs> William Barr. Barr testified to Congress for several hours, but rather than give you the full testimony, I'll give you a four-joke summary. <laughs> well, three and a half jokes. Uh, that was the half joke just now. <laughs> Barr had a big announcement about when we can expect to see the full Mueller report. My original timetable uh, of being able to release this uh, uh, by mid-April stands. Within a week, uh, I will be in a position to release the port to the public. Wow, Barr just broke huge news. Within a week, it will be mid-April. <laughs> also, we might see some of the Mueller report. Uh, only some, because Barr has been up late working with his redacting pen. I identified four areas that I feel should be redacted. Uh, nouns, verbs, <laughs> adjectives, and uh, the spaces in between. Conjunction, I'm kidding, obviously. Here's what Barr identified as parts that needed redaction. Grand jury information, information that the ICE, the intelligence community believes would reveal intelligence sources and methods, information in the report that could interfere with ongoing prosecutions, information uh, that implicates the privacy or reputational interests of peripheral players where there is a decision not to charge them. With all that stuff missing, it's going to read like an investigative Mad Libs. The very gooey president and his smelly staff of White House kangaroos willfully and repeatedly obstructed the toilet. <laughs> Still. Yeah. They plug them in. Still pretty damning. Luckily, Barr has had an organizational system for everything he's redacting. We will color code the excisions from the report. And we have a preview of Barr's color coding system. Let's see. Black means confidential. <laughs> Red means grand jury information. And yellow means the Moscow Ritz Carlton. <laughs> we got a great show.